Hello guys, how is it going? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel and welcome back to a new video. I hope you're all doing great and having a wonderful day today. Today we are going to jump back into Hogwarts Legacy, so with no further ado, let's just jump right in. Last time we finished off helping this lady, she was attacked by Ashwinders, Duelists or whatever they were called. Uh, so some new enemies. Oh wow, the castle looks beautiful. Look at that. The grass is in the way. But that is beautiful. So, before going back to Hogwarts, um, the quest says, as much as, find Scrope's note in the courtyard. So we're going back to the courtyard of Hogwarts. But there was a quest uh, nearby here. So I'm thinking we're starting off with that, just so we get to stay outside of the school a little bit more. Um, and just see a little bit more of what's going on around here, you know. So let's talk to this guy. I never thought Ramrock's... Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ranrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. Oh. It was nice meeting you. I mean, a goblin being a painter is better rare, right? They usually work with gold and metal. But uh, let's After do this. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Yeah, I don't think a lot of uh, goblins actually wants to follow um, Ranrock or whatever. After what he did, I mean, not all the goblins are bad. What is going on? Expelliarmus. No, that is wrong. I thought I had Lumos, but I don't. Get some uh, moonstones. There's definitely some enemies out here, that's for sure. What is this? Beasts, welcome. Rebellion. Uh, her. Herberdine Black Scale. The Herberdine Black is a large dragon that can grow to over nine meters in length. A large rough scale originally belonged to one of those. One of these beasts is one of the prized possessions that Archie Bickle keeps in his hideout. All right. Good for that guy, I guess. Ah, sheep or goats? I don't know. Looks like we're going quite a little bit of a distance. Past the ruins. Uh, I'm on the right track. What in the actual... Oh, hell no. Ugh. Shame you're so foul. Spider. Spider. Oh, you can... You can just... Oh, yeah, right off with that. Mm-mm. There is something over there. That must be it. Yeah, that must be the camp. Oh, there's some enemies over there. This must be it. Yeah, this must be it. All right. Uh, so we're just going to fly in here. There's more than one way to enter. So, um, 
Um, I don't know. Steal a loyalist stranger's crossbow bolt. How do we do that? No idea what the heck I'm doing. <laughs> Should I be doing this? We're close to a <laughs> I can feel it. Quite an enchantment. The carts are turning to arms. They're not gonna notice. Ah! Defeat an enemy with ancient magic. Okay. Uh, are they stuck? Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Enjoy suffering, do you? Incendio. I don't think you know who you're dealing with. Ah, hold on. Um. Boom! How do we steal a boat? Oh darn, can't see shit. There we go. Ah, oh, wrong person, wrong, wrong one though. I want you to use it on you. one that has more. Oh my. in store for me this time. Run, 
He's the one shooting. You won't get away with that. Oh, we did it! <laughs> Just setting it back at him. Get up. Where'd he go? Is that it? <laughs> oh, I have flowers? Ooh. Rebellion. Um, what am I supposed to do with this? Incendio. I'm supposed to place something there, but uh, what am I supposed to place? I can. Just want to make sure there's there's something up here. I like the new rope we have. It's nice. Okay. I need to find something that I can put there. Rebellion. Ooh, can I carry this? This looks like it goes there. Where am I? Crap. Am I supposed to Aha! Nice. Is that it? Was Was that it? No. Rebellion. Oh. Okay, there's more here. Let me open. Action. Incendio. Action. Come on. This way, rocks. We go. It's got to be one more. Rebellion. Oh, here we go. Okay, there's rocks over there. Oh, there's the, oh, there's one. Okay, so those rocks were okay. Action. There we go. So I, uh, yeah, well, we got the rocks in place, okay? That's all that matters. Oh, nice, sweet. Can we 
and still hit him. We can't hit him. An intruder! You don't believe you can defeat me, do you? Okay, let's go back to the goblin. Oh, there's a thing over here. Anyways, <laughs> no daily data. Oh, there's a. Oh, there's more Merlin trials. Hmm. But I don't know how many uh, Mallow Sweets I have. So let's just go back, talk to the goblin. And then we're going to return to Hogwarts. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Yeah, no shit. It's a place of magic, dude. If you're here for my wares... On, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. It was no trouble. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. That sounds great, guy. What's a nice idea, Mr. Ron. Goblin, sir? I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. You're welcome. That's nice. I hope he succeeds. All the best to you. Once my carts arrive, I'd be happy to show you my wares. Cool. I'll return for that. Now, we are going back to Hogwarts. Hogwarts. And we are going all the way uh, to here. I guess this is the closest for this. I guess this is the closest because it's the courtyard. Oh, it's right out outside the courtyard. Or ne cross next to it? I <laughs> it's right there. There we go. Oh, we know this courtyard. We know this courtyard very well. Oh, wow. It's amazing to see it like this. Oh, it's great. Oh. Scrope knows about that book you found. Is it missing something? Scrope does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open. Scrope has left another note across the bridge along the circle of rocks. Take care. Tell no one about this. What? Scrope? Who is Scrope? I, dude, I have no idea. Oh, there it is. The Well of Four Beasts. Some students believe that a wish made over the Well of Four Beasts, whether near the Thestral, Griffin, Chimera, or Hippogriff, will come true for one who has gained the trust of any of the four. Cool. Okay, so we're getting looking for notes from Scrope. Revelio. There. No, not you. Well, I do know you.
Almost there, head for the pumpkins, just down from the stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor, broken-hearted Scrope. What? Pumpkins? Ah, I think I know just the place. Yeah, there were pumpkin, pumpkins down here, was it? Yeah, there we go. Who the heck is Scrope? Who's Scrope? I'm sorry, it's scaring you, Mr. Scarecrow. Um, I don't know which one I'm looking for. Look inside one of them. Well, we're just gonna open up all of them. There we go. The young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. Down to the water's edge? Hmm. This had better not be a trick. Better not. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Careful, dude. What is that? What is this? Okay, no, no, no. <laughs> Focus. <laughs> Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. Been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Uh. Sure, I I'm not going to talk to the headmaster anyways, because he's a pain in the butt. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. Uh, sure. Sure. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Thank you. Scrope will wait right here for you. Best of luck finding your pages. And the ring. Yeah, sure. Sure. Oh, this is beautiful, though. <gasps> what the fuck? Shit! He's barely doing anything. Jesus!
Oh, tell me you're stuck. No, nope, not anymore. I did not plan on fighting these guys. There we go. Oh, there's more? What the hell? I'm not talking. I'm dead. Stop targeting people. Just go! Swim for your life! Swim for your life. Swim for your life. They're 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 higher level than me, and I'm fucking died. They better not follow me in here. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. Journal. Could it be a visitor? Oh, ah. Ooh. <laughs> ah. The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say, I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. Mm, well, I need those pages. I'd like to have those pages, if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happened next. <laughs> Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to find the pages? That sounds great. Let's ask him some questions. I think I could guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After that, I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for, specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. Really? <laughs> Obviously, it's just in the game, though. <laughs> How was it funny possible it was to real. steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor, whatever's sure to cause the most chaos. He dropped them after a particularly aggressive romp through the library. 
I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Lovely. <laughs> that's great, dude. Revelio. Anything here? Well, there's a chest. Oh, there's another treasure chest. We have a bridge. A Lumos thing. Whatever. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Ghost of our love. Okay. Okay. Oh, they're still going to be out there, aren't they? Uh, we got to talk. So let's go back and talk to Scrope. At least. Still going to have company out. Yeah, of course we're still going to have company out. Here. Yeah, look at that. They're waiting for us. God, be shitting me. Oh, for crying out loud. I am not in the mood for this shit. Fuck alone. Leave me alone. Swim. Swim, young Slytherin. Swim for your life. It's following me! God, are you kidding me? I can't fight in water. Oh, it stopped? Yeah. Don't follow me. All right, let's tell him the bad news about the ring. Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's Grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. We are going to end the video here, you guys. Um... Next time, we will go to the Forbidden Forest, I believe. Um, I think that's what we're going to do. And continue. I'm looking forward to enter the Forbidden... I hope we're going to enter the Forbidden Forest. I don't know if it's going to be inside of Forbidden Forest, or outside of Forbidden Forest, or around the Forbidden Forest. I don't know, but I'm looking forward to head over there and... Breaking some more rules. You know, it's fun. Not in real world, though, but, you know, in the game, it's fun. Anyways, we're going to end it here. I do want to thank you guys so much for watching. Really hope you guys enjoyed. If you liked the video, drop me a like and drop me your thoughts in the comments down below. would really much appreciate that. But what I appreciate more is you guys spending a few minutes here. It really means a lot. So thank you so much that you guys take care of yourself. Stay safe, and I hope to catch you next time. Take care.